fuck? Hey, Vito, rise and shine. Jesus. Buddy, <laughs> stop fucking yelling, will you? My head's killing me. <laughs> Sorry, Joey. Stop calling me fucking Joey. What the hell's wrong with you? Vito, come on down. Jesus Christ. Who the hell was that? Guy's got a voice like Woody fucking Woodpecker. That was Marty. Remember the little kid used to live down the street from me? I had to pick up the truck here, so he gave me a lift. What's going on with the truck? It's gonna make us some nice cash. Hop in. I'll explain on the way. You drive. Where to? Riverside. All right, Riverside it is. Some night, huh? Yeah, you could say that. All right. You ain't still mad, are you? Nah, very instead. That's the first thing I wanted to do. Hey, come on. You had fun at the game. What now? Now we take care of our customers. These guys here buying bulk from us. Come with me. Okay, climb up and hand me the goods. Hi, one carton of reds. Hand me a cotton of reds, Vito. Yeah, that's the one. Here it is. Hey, good to see you. I'm all out of smokes. Give me a cotton of blues. One cotton of blues, Vito. All right. Hand it over. Here it is. What the fuck? Hey, Sarge, how you doing? Caught in the blues as usual? I think I'll take the whites this time. Hear that, Vito? Let's go. Cotton of whites. Bingo. Thanks, Joe. Now get the hell out of here, will you? Okay, time to go. Get in, Vito. Next stop is Millville. It's going great today. We're making some serious dough here. Here 
Here it is. What you selling, Mac? You buying or just window shopping? Maybe. We're selling smokes. Two bucks a carton, hundred bucks a crate. I'll make you a deal. You fuck over ten cartons, and maybe we'll let you and your buddy get out of here in one piece. Hey, look, pal. How about you get back in your cute little car with your little friends there, and I'll pretend I never seen you. Sound good? <laughs> you don't get it, do you, you fat motherfucker? This is our turf, and it's gonna cost you to operate here. Now pay up. You're the one who doesn't get it. You have any idea who you're talking to? One last chance. You walk away now and... Yeah, I'll tell you who I'm talking to. A fat two-bit fucking Dago door-to-door -door salesman hocking stolen cigarettes on my turf. And it's time to close up shop, asshole. Okay, boys. I think it's time for a fire sale. Shit. Don't. Oh, fuck. <laughs> what do you say now? Oh, what do I gotta say? That's right. Come on, hop in that car and let's go. All right, let's get one of these fucks and teach them a lesson. Step on it, Vito. He's getting away. I got it floored, Joe. This thing won't go anymore. Me, Vito. Listen, we got a problem. We were moving the smokes, and these, uh, these greases came out of nowhere and set the fucking truck on fire. What? You fucking kidding me? You couldn't handle a bunch of grease balls? What the fuck happened? Look, look, Eddie, Eddie, Eddie. Listen, it's not our fault, okay? They set the fucking truck on fire before we knew what was happening, and everything burned up. All right, we popped one of the guys, but... What do I fucking care? Just bring me my money. I paid two grand for that truck, and I want it back. Lucky for you two retards, I got Derek's guy Steve here with me. And we were just talking about what to do with those punks. We're gonna take care of them now. Steve will meet you at the Crazy Horse. You know it? Okay. Crazy Horse. Yeah, I know where it is. Steve's gonna have a few guys with him. Show them that nobody fucks with us. No shooting, though. So it looks like just another gang fight. I don't want to read about a bloodbath in the papers tomorrow. Oh, right, sure. Don't worry. We'll take care of it. All right, we gotta meet Steve in front of the crazy horse. Good news is he's gonna help us out. Bad news is Eddie wants his money back. All too grand. Shit! You really think we're gonna get two G's out of these guys? Hey, Steve. Hey. Hey, guys. Party? What are you doing here? Hey, Joe. I'm going with you on this one. Steve needed help. He said I could come along. Steve, uh, isn't this, uh... Kids gotta learn sometime. Okay, why are we here, Steve, huh? The guys we're looking for are all headed to the foundry. This is where they usually meet, so we'll start here, then head over to the foundry to finish the job. And, uh, why'd you volunteer to help us? Those bastards trashed my cousin's car. They robbed him and knocked out three of his teeth. Yeah, those fucking assholes. They make problems all over the city. What'd you Shut do up, today? kid. I'm talking here. So, like the Bible says, an eye for an eye, tooth for a tooth. And, well, we'll just start with this joint. So what's the plan? First, we're gonna trash this place. And how are we gonna do that? 
with this. Go ahead, boys. Hey, come on, guys. <laughs> now you can either help us or stay out of our way. <laughs> Let's go teach these fuckers a lesson. <laughs> what the fuck was that? Vito, Marty, I got some Molotov cocktails in the trunk. Go get them and throw them in. <laughs> My pleasure, Steve. What are you waiting for? Grab the bottle and chuck it in. It ain't that hard. <laughs> That'll teach him. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. Now we go to the boundary. Get in, boys. We'll meet you two at the main gate. See you there. <laughs> 